being centrally located madhya pradesh is often referred to as the heart of india the state is bound on the north by uttar pradesh the east by chatisgarh the south by maharashtra and the west by gujarat and rajasthan the topography of madhya pradesh is defined by the narmada son valley it is narrow and long valley extending through almost the whole of the state from east to west it has diverse physiography with a large plateaus numerous mountain ranges meandering rivers and miles of forest supporting rich biodiversity the total area of madhya pradesh is 308245 square kilometer and it ranks second among the other states madhya pradesh is that part of the peninsular plateau of india where residual soils are found in an extensive area the state can be divided into five major categories namely alluvial soil black soil medium and deep black colored soil is extensively found in the valley of narmada river malwa plateau and satpura mountain range which contains about 20 to 60% clay and has a depth of near about 1 to 2 meters the forest covers in the state is 77482.49 square kilometer which is 25.14% of state geographical area in terms of forest canopy density classes the state has 6676.02 square kilometer under very dense forest 34341.40 square kilometer under moderately dense forest and 36465.07 square kilometer under open forest forest cover in the state has increased by 68.49 square kilometer as compared to the previous assessment reported in 2017 some of the famous national parks in madhya pradesh are kana national park in balaghat bandavar national park in umaria panna national park in panna and chatrapur satpura national park in ozangabad Madhya Pradesh is a state in north central India is subtropical with a substantial 1400 mm monsoon rains that feed a large number of streams and rivers the largest of these by volume is the Narmada followed by the Tapti Madhya Pradesh falls in five major river basins the northern part of the state falls within the Ganges basin where the Betwa Chambal and Son flow the south of the Ganges basin is the narmada basin the second largest by surface area the other three basins cover small portions of madhya pradesh namely the mahi basin to the west the tapti basin and the godavari basin to the south madhya pradesh is endowed with sufficient surface water the total surface water availability in the chambal betwa ken river catchment is 45 cubic kilometer 29.29 cubic kilometer is in the Sun River catchment 52.43 cubic kilometer in the Mahanadi River catchment 40.83 cubic kilometer in the Narmada River catchment and 4.53 cubic kilometer in Vaiganga and Pench River catchments Madhya Pradesh has a subtropical climate with three distinct reasons winter December to February summer March to May and the rainy season June to October summer temperatures fluctuates between a minimum of 22 degrees celsius and a maximum of 38 degrees celsius though it can get very hot with temperatures up to 48 degrees celsius the current annual average rainfall for the state is 1160 mm with the heaviest rains in the southeastern parts of the decreasing towards the northwest most of the rainfall is received from the south asian monsoon during june to september which in madhya pradesh accounts for more than 90% of the total annual rainfall the state's flora and fauna varies from place to place in the mountain range of satpura and maika trees like teak sal and bamboo are some of the varieties found in abundance these also are the important commercial variety of flora of the state moreover 
the state as a rich store of wildlife the state being the host of good number of wildlife sanctuaries like the khan wildlife sanctuary shivpuri bandavagad and reva have some of the rare species of wildlife of the country the swamp deer bison and the white tiger are some of the wildlife found here the population of madhya pradesh is 7.27 crores the male population is 3.76 crores the female population is 3.56 crores and the transgender population is 29597 there are 931 females per 1000 males in madhya pradesh hinduism forms the majority religion in 50 out of 50 districts of madhya pradesh hinduism constitutes 90.89 percentage islam 6.57 percentage christianity 0.29 percentage sikh 0.21 percentage and jainism is 0.78 percentage with the 46 recognized scheduled tribes the state has the highest ranking of the population of indigenous peoples the tribal communities occupy the slopes of the region's mountains and are bounded by the narmada and godavari rivers they are gond tribe bil baiga saharia abjumar bahadia korku sanshia kols and savras the overall literacy rate of madhya pradesh is 69.3 percentage and the female literacy is 59.2 percentage originally known as malwa the place has nurtured some epic rulers and warriors as well like emperor ashoka chandragupta vikramaditya harshavardhana raja bhoj and many others a long revealing history forged by this great man is preserved in book and ink the musical lineage of madhya pradesh is nurtured all over the state in the forms of classical folk and tribal music the tribal people of bastar truly could sing their way through every problem the instruments used by them are extraordinary itself singa might just be the first instrument ever forged by man marias are richly ornamented brass trumpets and punji or bean is popular with the jogis and snake charmers in india madhya pradesh's arsenal is filled with folk songs the folklore of dola moru is commonly sung around the regions of malwa nimmer and bandelkhand it's about the dola moru story of love separation and reunion the melodious music of chang and daf is readily played in the parts of mandla malwa Bandalkan and Nimmer the music is magnetic Some of the folk dance of Madhya Pradesh are Javra Ada Kadanach Pulpati Grida dance Shalalaki and Manch Among many popular folk dances of Madhya Pradesh Tetali deserves special mention It is considered to be one of the oldest form of folk dance. The dance is an extravagant display of rituals with the different types of dances incorporated in a single performance. Kamar tribes, a minor community in Madhya Pradesh, presents Tetel folk dance with their unique rituals. This renowned tribal dance is also known as Tara Tali by the locals. Matki dance is basically a solo dance from ladies wearing colorful dress perform this dance. This dance is performed on different occasions like birthdays, weddings or any cultural events. This dance is performed with the water pots. The folk dance started in central India. Manch dance is the lyrical folk ballad of Madhya Pradesh. It is practiced by the people from the Malwa region in the state and is very different form of the tribal folk dance originating from the state of Madhya Pradesh and other states in India the manch dance is performed in the native malwi language and performed in a drama and ballet form people also consider manch dance as the indian form of opera in the native language while the performers are dancing a mesmerizing technique Lokrang festival Lokrang is a cultural festival in which all the dancers put their best foot forwards and matches their steps with the folk music during the festival the stage displays the various forms of folk dances music and ethnic dances 
అఖిల్ భారతీయ కాళిదాస్ స్వమారా ఇట్ ఇస్ అన్ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ ఫెస్టివల్ రైటర్స్ పోయిట్స్ ఫ్రమ్ అరౌండ్ ద వరల్డ్ కమ్ టుగెదర్ ఇన్ ద మార్చ్ ఆఫ్ ద సెవెన్ బ్రిలియన్ డేస్ ఆఫ్ పాయిట్ రిసిటేషన్ స్టోరీ టెల్లింగ్ అండ్ కల్చరల్ పర్ఫార్మెన్సెస్ ఖజిరావో ఫెస్టివల్ డాన్స్ అండ్ మ్యూజిక్ షుడ్ బీ ద మిడిల్ నేమ్ ఆఫ్ మధ్యప్రదేశ్ వన్ వీక్ లాంగ్ ఖజిరాహో డాన్స్ ఫెస్టివల్ ఈస్ ద మేనిఫెస్టేషన్ ఆఫ్ ద ట్రూ ఇండియాస్ డాన్స్ ఫార్మ్స్ all the performances take place in an open air stage right opposite to chitragupta and vishwanatha temple chetiyaguri vihara festival one can see the massive movement of buddhist monks and followers during the chetiyaguri vihara festival to sanchi people come here to see the relics of the two great disciples of buddha sariputta and maha mohalena sri kebab a well known mohalai cuisine is one of the madhya pradesh famous foods It's prepared by wrapping mines to meat around the scraper and then cooked in a coal fire. Smoky flavored delicious kebabs melts in your mouth. It's one of the Madhya Pradesh famous non-vegetarian dishes. It is served hot with chutneys or sauces. Palak puri traditionally a staple food of Madhya Pradesh is also a more popular street food dish of Indore. This healthy and nutritious Madhya Pradesh food recipe is eaten for breakfast or meal. prepared of wheat flour mixed with the spinach leaf paste and some spices and then deep fried art and flaky palak puri served with the spicy potato curry raita or pickle mawa bati is a delectable and ideal sweet dish can only be tasted in madhya pradesh it looks like a giant gulab jamun soft and has perfect shape and sweetness made of mawa dough that is mixed with the dry fruits and rolled into balls it is then deep fried and dipped in sugar syrup and garnished with coconut powder sabudana kichdi is a famous madhya pradesh food which can be eaten at any time of a day it's a simple and healthy dish more popularly eaten for breakfast made of soaked sabudana or sago potatoes spinach and spices well garnished with the farli namkin lemon juice and coriander leaves gujia is a delectable sweet dessert that is crispy and flattened outside sweet dumplings made of maida flour filled with a delightful koya dry fruits cardamom powder dry coconut and sugar gujia is well popular dessert prepared in madhya pradesh during festive occasions far framed for its rich legacy cultural and literal heritage the state has also boasts of its undying spirit and enthusiasm towards sport and its development cricket football hockey badminton chess athletics archery etc are popular sports in madhya pradesh water sports are also much popular in the state besides traditional games like kho kho gali danda and pitu are also famous in the rural areas of the state the vernacular architecture of madhya pradesh includes tribal styles of making houses pakka semi pakka and kacha the materials used to construct homes include mud bamboo and bricks the linear patterns on mud walls sloping roof and courtyard are pretty common in houses by our refers to the empty lot or area left in homes sanchi stupa one of the oldest monuments established in the state was constructed under the ruler ashoka 265 to 238 BCE in addition it is one of the oldest buddhist mounds built in india sanchi stupa a unesco world heritage site is located near the capital city of bhopal sanchi stupa is one of the largest stupas in india with 54 feet into 120 feet dimensions jas mahal of mandu sultan giyasuddin gilji commissioned the construction of this palace treated as a harem the mahal is a rectangular shaped two story structure between two artificial lakes the palace's location makes it appear floating on water hence living up to its name english text refers to the court as ship palace built in 1614 the datia mahal is one of the most exceptional indo islamic architecture in india with a multi storied open chamber surrounding the central courtyard the palace gives an aesthetic rajput style feel the pillars and corridors depict original designs the embellished ceiling of the persian carpets gives it as much mahal architectural feels as well the windows are unique showing mashrabi a style enclosed with latticed wood screens engraved with beautiful motif designs jay vilas palace of gwalior 
Sir Michael Philos built this architecture marvel of the 19th century under the reign of Maharaja Dheeraj Srimant Jai Jirao Sindhya. The palace shows a perfect blend of European architectural details. The first story shows the Tuscan style, while the second story of the court shows the Italian Doric style, and finally the third story depicts the detailed Corinthian architecture. The Darbar Hall, decorated with a gilt and gold furnishing, topped with the colossal royalist carpet and massive chandeliers, attracts the most attention. The chandelier is the heaviest in Asia. The economy of Madhya Pradesh refers to the economic growth with respect to the Indian state of Madhya Pradesh. It grew 12% in GDP for the year 2011 and 12, for which it received an award from the President Pranab Mukherjee in January 2013 for improving its tourism, medical and infrastructure growth. The economy of Madhya Pradesh is significantly agrarian, which is reflecting rapid strides towards industrial and service sectors as well. The Indore, Bhopal and Jabalpur districts are the top three districts in the state's largest economy. Madhya Pradesh ranks in the 10th place in GDP. As per agriculture, Madhya Pradesh holds the first rank in production of pulses and oil seeds and second position in production of food grains. Madhya Pradesh export products such as processed and unprocessed food, spice and organic products, plastic and packaging materials, herbal and pharmaceuticals, textile yarn and fabric, engineering and machine tools. Roughly two-thirds of the state's population is literate. There are schools for primary, middle and high school education, as well as specialized schools for polytechnics, industrial arts and crafts. According to the 2009 and 10 figures, the state had 1,5592 primary schools, 6,352 high schools and 5,161 higher secondary schools. The state has 208 engineering and architecture colleges, 208 management institutes and 12 medical colleges. The poor ranking of the state on the health index has proved that Madhya Pradesh continues to be the Bimaru state, claims the medical health experts, adding that the government needs to focus on strengthening primary health centers rather than stressing on improving the services at medical colleges and their associate hospitals. Madhya Pradesh has 1,335 primary health centers, 330 community health care centers, 86 sub-district hospitals and 51 district hospitals. 38 national highways of length 7,854 kilometers pass through the strait. Madhya Pradesh possesses a road network of around 1,60,000 kilometer. State highways are of around 11,000 kilometer in length. More than 455 trains transit through Madhya Pradesh daily. 220 trains transit through the state's capital Bhopal alone. North and south and east and west corridors cut across Madhya Pradesh. There is convenient access to major ports such as Kandala Port and Jawaharlal Nehru Port in the state. Bhopal, Indore, Jabalpur, Gwalior, Itasri, Ratlam, Bina, Katni and Guna are the main railway stations. Jabalpur is the headquarters of the West Central Railways. Located in the heart of India, Madhya Pradesh remains highly accessible from any part of the country. There are five key air terminals in Madhya Pradesh that argument air networking to the state. To know about the major airports located in Madhya Pradesh, Raja Bhoj International Airport in Bhopal, Gwalior Airport, Devi Ahilabai Olkar International Airport in Indore, Civil Airport in Kajuraho and Damna Airport, Jabalpur. The BJP and the Congress are the two major political parties of the state. The current Chief Minister of Madhya Pradesh is Shivraj Singh Chauhan. As the leader of the BJP, Chauhan served as a General Secretary and President of its Madhya Pradesh state. He joined the RSS in 1972 as a 13-year-old boy. He is five times a member of parliament, having represented Vidasha in Lok Sabha, the lower houses of the Indian parliament between 1991 and 2006. Sura Singh Chauhan serves as the 17th Chief Minister and he belongs to the BJP party. They won 130 seats out of 230. The leader of the opposition is Govind Singh of Indian National Congress 
and the party leader is Kamal Nath. Some of the famous leaders of Madhya Pradesh are Atal Bihari Vajpayee, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar, Dig Vijay Singh, Jai Badri Bachchan, Madhav Rao Cynthia, Shankar Dayal Sharma, Sharad Yadav, Shivraj Singh Chauhan, Uma Bharti and Najma Habdullah. Some of the famous personalities who contributed in other domains include Kishore Kumar, popular actor, Lata Mangeshkar, famous singer, Ustad Amir Khan, famous musician, Pandit Kumar Gandharva, Indian classical singer, Salman Khan, popular actor, Habib Tanvir, famous indie playwright, Raghuram Rajan, Governor of the Reserve Bank of India, and J.S. Verma, the 27th Chief Justice of India. 1949, the princely state of Bhopal merged into Union of India. The state of Madhya Pradesh comes into existence. 1967, first non-Congress government comes into ruling. 1982, Narmada Man, India's first human fossils found in the banks of the river Narmada. 1984, one of the worst disasters of India's, the Bhopal gas tragedy occurred. 2000, around 1.35 lakh square kilometers of southeastern part of Madhya Pradesh was carved out into Chhattisgarh, leading to the division of the state. Built in the 6th century, the Gwalior Fort is the pearl amongst the fortress in India. The striking feature of this fort lies in the digit zero, found in the architectural designs in the temples within the fort. Hathipul and Badalgarh Pul, the two gates of the fort, bag all the tourist attractions here. Today, the light shows and music performances act as a charm for the defense. The fort houses various palaces, out of which Manmandir Palace and Gujari Palace are the most popular ones. There are also various Buddhist and Jain temples within the fort. A must-visit attraction among nature lovers and adventure seekers, the 300 feet high Patalpani Falls is a great spot for camping, trekking and picnicking. Locals believe the depth of the Kun reaches below the ground level or Patal. No matter how enticing the waterfalls look for a dip, Keep yourself from entering the pool for safety reasons. Maheshwar Maheshwar, the Varanasi of Central India, is a small holy town dedicated to Lord Shiva. Set along the banks of the Narmada River, it is said that only Shiva is worshipped where the Narmada flows, as he is the only god with the inner peace to calm her. Omkareshwar Temple One of the most prominent historical places in Madhya Pradesh, Om Kareshwara Temple finds in the name of the bucket list of a lot of culture vultures in India. The temple is dedicated to Lord Shiva and is located on an island called Shivapuri in the river Narmada that resembles the shape of the Om symbol. It is one of the most revered religious sites of the followers of Hinduism as it is one of the 12 Jyotirlinga shrines of Shiva. Laying of Indore Devas Ujjain Railway Line in length of 80 km in Indore District, Nigri Super Thermal Power Project, Pinch National Park Diversion Irrigation Project, Bhopal Airport Expansion Project in Bhopal, and New Multi Speciality Hospital in Agar. And that's it for this episode. I hope you have enjoyed and learnt a lot from it. I will see you with another incredible state of India in the next and don't forget to subscribe our channel and share it with your friends.